Feng Shui, what do different symbols mean in Feng Shui? Symbols have been used in Feng Shui for a long time for numerous purposes. Some symbols are very well known like A tortoise, as a symbol of protection and stability A mandarin duck, as a symbol of love and marriage However, some are less known like bats and chilans This list of Feng Shui symbols will surely help you out in understanding more about these symbols before using the symbols, you should understand that there's a very subtle line between Feng Shui cures and Feng Shui symbols because symbols are used as cures in Feng Shui. Let's understand different Feng Shui symbols now. Flowers, flowers add the energy of grace and beauty to the homes. They also provide numerous blessings, flourishing, and good luck to any home. Placing real flowers in the home is always the best idea for bringing strong healing energy. High-quality silk flowers and images of flowers are also used in Feng Shui. Butterflies, the most common use of the butterfly symbol is for love and romance as it gives you the feeling of flying. It is also used for representing freedom. Horses, as you may expect, horses as a symbol in Feng Shui represent speed, fame, success, and freedom. That's why they're often used either in the fame Bagua area, southern area, or in the career Bagua area, northern area of living space. Birds, humans have looked at birds from the very beginning of life. A bird represents freedom, inspiration, and unity with the divine. Specific birds may have specific symbols because every bird has its own distinctive and unique qualities. Fruits, fruits represent the energy of fruition. They are used as symbols of prosperity, wealth, longevity, fertility, etc. Of course, specific fruits also have specific symbols. Fishes slash aquarium, fishes are also used as a symbol of wealth and the most famous fish is arowana or dragonfish. But the problem with them is that the purest arowana is cost quite expensive. So normally people use koi or golden fish as they work as effectively as an arowana. Eight or nine fishes work fine for an aquarium and it is great if one of them is black. Mystic knot, this is one of the most often used but less known symbols in feng shui. It represents a long life full of happiness and fortune. Buddha, when you have a very busy lifestyle, it's always a good choice to place this symbol of peace in your home for balancing the effect of active energies. Foo dogs, these are a strong symbol of protection and that's why they're often placed in front of temples, government offices, and imperial places. They also used to be a symbol of social status and family wealth and were placed in front of wealthy homes. Dragon, it is a symbol of wealth, power, opportunities, and strong yang male energy. It doesn't require any special place and having a feng shui dragon in almost any part of your home is auspicious.